John Moore reporting for BellAlliant.net from the Halifax Civic Center here where just moments ago, Team New Brunswick capturing the gold medal, a 7-2 win over the Bedford Blues here, joined by the coach Bobby Freeze. Bobby, congratulations on the win here, an impressive victory here. What were the keys to success here this afternoon? This afternoon, our guys all played extremely well from the defense right out as the goaltender, the defense, the forwards. They were coming back, they were forechecking. It was a great game. Uh, we were down uh, Ryan Kenny in this here situation today, which was uh, picked the MVP of the, the tournament. And the guys pulled up their socks. They went out. They uh, they battled and they uh, they really performed well. The tournament in the whole was great. Uh, all the teams were great, and it was a great opportunity for our kids to get a chance to play at something at this level. Bobby, not only winning it, but winning it impressively, just to come out and get a one nothing lead, but then you all of a sudden broke it wide open. Well, the players the players that we have, when you have that line of Plurd, Nick Blanchard and Richard, uh, when they're on their game, they're pretty hard to stop. Yeah, Richard was out of the lineup, but he's back in you, so you get the, that line together, and then Jan Gord, uh, Plurd, rather, with a, with four points, two goals, two assists, and did he feel perhaps a little more pressure, the fact that you had Ryan Kenny out, and they... Did he have to provide more leadership? Well, he was told that he was going to have to get the extra work and uh, do the extra work today, and uh, that's what he did. And uh, he came out and he played his A game, and all the players played their A game, and it was just a great win. Why does that line have the success? We talked about Blanchard, Richard, and and uh, Plourde. They've been playing together for a while there now, and they just know each other is on the ice all the time. You can just see just the way they move the puck, bang, 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 it's in the net, bang, 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 it's in the net. They know where the next guy is going to be. They're, they're just great players, and you have to take into consideration, these kids are 11 and 12 years old. I can't believe the level of hockey here at 11 and 12 years old. Unbelievable. How do you, how do you feel right now after this 7-2 win over the Bedford Blues? Good. Can you, uh, can you try to describe for me how the feeling was? Because this was such a big game and you were missing one of your key players in Ryan Kenny. Describe to me the feeling. Uh, it's really, really funny because uh, it's hard. Uh, we play a uh, visit a uh, great player and all that. And it's a big tournament. Big tournament indeed, and uh, again, you, you lost yesterday to Halifax, but you bounced back. And this was a very impressive victory, not just a victory, but a 7-2 win. Tell me a little bit about the conversations in the room before the game. We say uh, we can uh, win the final and just a loss. You had two goals and two assists here this afternoon. You had a terrific tournament. Tell me about your game. Uh, I like my game. I will uh, don't stop that and put the puck in the net. Did you feel any more pressure, the fact that Ryan Kenny was out missing this game? Did you feel more pressure that you might have to provide more leadership? No, I play a game at like all the game. Is this the biggest win of your hockey career? When you look back over your career, and it's, you're only early in your career, but how big a win is this today? It's a big win. Uh, I don't win a big game like that uh, in my career. It's very funny. And what, what do you think the key was? What was the key? Why, why, did, you, why did you win so impressively here today? Uh, play hard and pause the puck and good it. How important a victory is this for, for New Brunswick? And, and uh, I know that the Moncton Hawks a couple of years ago won, won but it's, I think it's been, I understand, uh, almost 15 years, if not more, since the last time a team from northern New Brunswick has, has captured an Atlantic championship. It's important. It's important to the province. Uh, we're, we started a new program. We had that program, and we have four sections in the province, and we got Edge and North. And it's very important for, for our guys. It gives us a chance to compete at the, our level, and then all of a sudden when we come to something like this here is the top level and you're playing against the best players in all of Atlantic Canada and it's just unbelievable. It's an unbelievable uh, experience for myself and personally plus the team and the coaches and the players. It was just a great time. Well, congratulations again, Bobby. Uh, Bobby Fries, the head coach for uh, Team New Brunswick. And again, they win the gold here 7-2 to two over the Bedford Blues. I'm John Moore reporting for BellAlliance.net.